excuse me. Excuse me, ma'am. The scene at the Scammon Farm in Stratham, New Hampshire. It's a site where Mitt Romney started his campaign a year ago in 2011, and where he's starting the be, beginning his uh, bus tours, five day, six state tour called Every City Counts. We've opened up our phone lines for your thoughts on the speech you just saw, the Romney campaign. Here are the numbers. If you're a Republican, it's 202 624 1111. For Democrats, that number is 202 624 1115. And for in New Hampshire residents, special line set aside for you, 202-624-0760. Make sure you mute your television or radio when you call in, and we'll get to your calls next. Part of our coverage today of the Mitt Romney campaign, the next stop is Milford, New Hampshire, and we'll, we'll be there live as well at 1130. Let's go to Julio, who's waiting in Chicago on our Republican line. Julio, good afternoon. Uh, good morning. Go ahead. Uh, good. Uh, good afternoon. Good morning. Um, I am still on the fence on the support for Governor Mitt Romney. Uh, just been doing a lot of research on campaign contributions, what he said previously, and I'm someone that uh, supports auditing the Federal Reserve and someone that supports uh, limited government, a constitutional government. And, you know, Mitt Romney at one point on Larry King Live said that. Uh, ben Bernanke's doing a good job, that we shouldn't audit the Fed, and now that Rand Paul is supposedly endorsing him, he may back out on that. And looking at campaign contributions, Goldman Sachs and some of the top banking firms donating to Obama, I'm really on the fence, and I'm hoping that you know, Gary Johnson's able to get on the debate platform, because I think if the American people get at least another choice, at least three men on the stage, it could make this process a bit better. And, you know, I read Charlie Skelton of the London Guardian report that Mitt Romney supposedly was at Bilderberg, and he may pick Mitch Daniels as his vice presidential nominee. If that's the case, then this country's going to get conned, similar to Obama back in 2008. So your, your candidate is, uh, is uh, Gary Johnson? Yeah, I'm supporting Gary Johnson. I think Gary Johnson matches more of my constitutional ideology compared to Mitt Romney. And hopefully C-SPAN could have Governor Johnson on at the same time uh, this election season. Governor Johnson, like I said, he's a governor, two-term governor, similar to uh, Mitt Romney. We're well, we have covered a couple of his events, Julio, including the uh, Libertarian, uh, Libertarian Convention just a, a couple of weeks ago. Here's Huntington, West Virginia, and on our uh, Democrats line, Donna. 